I'm Brittany Huddleston. I'm from Ohio, actually. Um, and I've been involved in the pro-life movement for a few years doing activism on campus. I really, really enjoyed it. I'm so glad that I ended up here working with CVR for the summer. I just think it was such a random way that I even ended up here because I was actually at a Students for Life conference where I got the brochure and I had like heard of like the abortion victim imagery but I hadn't really thought about using it that much. I was definitely converted like that first time we did activism like I believe that it worked before but I was like oh I feel like over the summer, like I've had more worthy conversations using the victim imagery than I had before with other displays. And it's not that those weren't important, but I just think it got to the heart of the issue a lot quicker because you can't deny the, or the reality of abortion that it's killing a person when you're sitting there looking at it. It's really hard to get away from. Yeah, I mean, it's definitely challenged me a lot and put me in some places where I wasn't necessarily comfortable all the time. But I think that was necessary for my growth and just understanding like the gravity um, of the issue that we're facing that, I mean, of course, this isn't just an opinion I have. This is real. This isn't a preference where we are defending life. And it's not that I didn't know that before, but I just feel like that was solidified even more in me. Especially when we watched the videos, like first say the choice blues, and we saw the procedure being performed. We literally saw the baby's hands and feet being ripped apart before they even got a chance at life. And that that's like something I can't forget. And I feel like it's one of those things where if you see it, I mean, I don't know how you couldn't say something about it. I'd say like, especially to Christians, like I feel like a lot of people think that this isn't our problem, but it absolutely is our problem. It isn't other people. This is within our own churches. It is out in the community. And we just need to be a lot better about shying, not shying away from the fact that yes, we are killing God's children, that he, we are killing his creation, and we just don't have the right to decide who gets to live and dies, and we're not gonna.